What I began to put together was the missing pieces that I found in the experiences that I had. I would go away and have these amazing breakthroughs and then I would go back into my normal life, the real world, and I would find myself go back into old patterns. And I saw this everywhere. What I became really passionate about was creating community of what we call pack. So that when we have breakthroughs as men, when we have really big developments in ourselves, that we can maintain that momentum and trajectory. That was the first piece, understanding that I needed to be around people that were on the same journey and I needed to be that consistently. I needed to be around them with a frequency that I could live my life in partnership with those men. The next piece that I discovered was that this fire that kind of lit inside me when I went through this experience of men's work, realizing that's what I wanted to do, was something that very few people experience. This sense of real drive and a clarity of where they're going and the direction that they want their life to go in was not something that was commonly experienced. So I discovered that this piece of purpose was incredibly powerful and very missing in men's lives. I realized that you can have an idea of where you want your life to go and you can have people around you that can support you, but you still need the conviction, the confidence and the momentum to move forward and to execute. Changing your life trajectory is a really challenging process. I went from being a very successful mining consultant, leaving that career, creating Primal Man Project as a movement and spending six months, 12 months, building it up to a place where it was sustainable as a business. It took a lot of conviction. And the, the distinction that we share in the work I do is we talk about that as power. We used to have experiences in our ancient times where young boys were given an opportunity to be tested and to be initiated into manhood. And what that gave them was a deep sense of confidence in who they were and who they are. And they were then held inside of a community and a tribe that said, this is you as a man and this is what is expected of you. And we believe in you and we require this of you. That experience of initiation and rite of passage was a really powerful accelerant to my growth. And it's something that forms the third piece in the work that we do, a man's personal power.